Hey everybody, this is Robert from uh, Bishop Vending. Uh, we're going to do another video today on the uh, mini claw machine. Uh, today we're going to uh, set the uh, voltages for the claw. Um, the voltages will determine what it picks up. Uh, so you can see the settings on and see how everything gets set up for uh, for what it can pick up and what the strength has to be. Okay, first thing we got to do is uh, uh, open it up and uh, go to the menu. See, right now mine is on uh, uh, free games. That's just so I don't have to put any quarters in. I can just play the machine anytime I want. So, uh, all right. Let's uh, Open up the uh, coin mech, and behind there is the magic red button. You hit it, and then you can uh, see the menu. Oh, and that screen is real bright up there. Okay. So uh, right now it's on basic settings. We're gonna, uh, you move the uh, joystick down, it will go down uh, to the next setting. You hit the button and then it will enter that, that certain one. Now the PR, that's, uh, I have it set on three. That means on every uh, third play, the claw will go into strong mode. There's a strong mode and a weak mode and then there's an LG or LVA mode on it. Uh, I'll try and explain each one of those. The strong mode is um, is where you you put the voltage on it to where the uh, customer is going to win a prize. So you set the voltage high. That way the the claw has as much strength as possible to grab whatever it is, follow it all the way through, and then drop it in the slot. Okay, I have mine set to three. You can set it to anything you want. I believe the highest you can go is $9.99. So it could be a hundred or 999 times before somebody wins. So you can set this. I like three. Um, each one of the plush uh, cost me about 28 cents, somewhere around there. Uh, it's 50 cents to play. So that means for $1.50, they should win a prize. So I think it's a good... Uh, uh, ratio. There's a couple uh, modes. Uh, let me see if I can go through each one of them. I, I believe there's actually three of them. Uh, there's a random mode, there's a guaranteed mode, and there's a mandatory win mode. I believe the machines come uh, guaranteed mode, which is mode F. If you move it uh, left and right, you can go to F. That's the uh, guaranteed mo mode. What this does is uh, on the third time, because it's set to uh, probability is set to three, on every third time it will go to strong. And then if you don't win on the third one, the fourth one it'll go back to weak. And then the fifth one will be weak. And then the sixth one will be strong again. So it's every third one it will be strong and you have a whole lot better chance of winning. Now, um, the other mode, which is G, uh, that is the uh, mandatory win mode. And what that does is on the first and second one, it'll be weak, and on the third one, it will be strong. And if you don't win a prize, the fourth one will still be strong. The fifth one will be strong as long as you don't win a prize. That way, it's you have a better chance of getting the prize out. Um, the random mode is R, and what that is, is uh, since this is set to three, somewhere between one and three times, it will be a strong one, and it's random. You don't get to pick which one. So if you put it at 10, that means on the uh, fifth time they use it, it could be strong, or the third time, or the seventh time, it's a random number in between there where it will be strong. The other times it will be weak. Okay? Okay, so we're going to set ours on G, which is a mandatory win mode. 
which means everyone after the third one will be strong until they win. And then once they win, it will go back to weak again. Okay? Let's go uh, down and go to return. So we go back. And now we're going to go to the parameters. Down and hit the button to go into the parameter. Now, the top one up here, which is the S, uh, C1, which was S claw, the voltage is 43. That is the strong voltage. The uh, time here, this is the strong voltage time. This is how long it will stay uh, that way when it, when it goes down and picks up the toy. Uh, C3 is the weak law. That's the voltage when it's any other time besides the one time where you're supposed to win. And the L, uh, L, G, and V, uh, that is the, after, if it's on a week, um, when it grabs the toy and then it picks it up, as soon as it picks it up, the L, G, V kicks in. And that's the voltage that will hold it as it comes up and then goes all the way over to drop it into it. So you can set that voltage to where it will pick it up, but the L, G, V will be low and it'll drop it before it actually gets to the hole. Okay, so we're gonna uh, go into some of those. I'm gonna actually go to strong, and then I'm gonna show you how you can adjust your toy and, and figure out what voltage you need. Okay, so let's uh, set this up. We're gonna, uh, actually I'm gonna go ahead and set the voltage on it uh, low. Let's set it to uh, 25. All right. And I'm going to open this up. Okay. I'm going to grab me a Pokemon ball. Now what you do is, is when it's in that, it's set on C1, you can push the, the ball up there. Okay, as soon as you press down the button, then it holds it. See, watch. If I press down the button, it will close the claw. So it's closing it at 25 volts. So you hold this up there and you press it and you let go. Does it hold the ball? No, it doesn't. So it's too weak. So you need to set it higher. So we're going to go ahead and set it up higher. And let's set it to, we're going to say 34. Okay. And then we'll take a look at it again. You hit the button and it closes it. So I'm going to hold this up there, hit the button and let go. Nope, it still didn't hold it. So it's still too weak to hold the ball. So I'm going to go higher. And I'm going to set it on 40. Okay, set it on 40. And now I'm going to hold it in there, hit the button, let go, and it held it. So 40 is strong enough to hold the ball. You let go and the ball falls. So now my strong setting is at 40. And Okay. So we know it'll hold the ball at 40. So let's try and set our weak now. Okay. When you set the weak one, it's the same thing as the strong. We're going to set ours. Uh, I actually had mine set on 23. I thought that was a good uh, setting for it. You kind of want to take the uh, lightest um, toy that you have in there and you want to set it on the weak. That way it's the lightest thing that's in there because now this one right here, anything that's under 40 is, well, anything under 35 will, will drop it, but you actually want it to fall through. You don't want it to grab. You want the, the claw to close, but you don't want it to actually grab onto the, the thing. To the toy okay so uh, I got mine set to 23 if you have something that's really light and you set it on 23 it may hold it so you'd have to drop the voltage down more so it would actually let go of it <clears throat> 
and the uh, so now we have that set we're gonna set the LGV this one is actually set at 35 and what that will do is I'll show you 35 seem like a good one um, we'll set to oops. we'll set it to uh, 30 that's in between the two so it should drop it as it's coming up as the ball is coming up I believe um, the higher you set it means the higher it goes up before it actually drops the ball uh, 35 it got to right about here before it dropped the ball down so I'm thinking the other one if we set it 30 it should drop it about here okay so let's actually do a test we have those uh, settings in so you go back to uh, return and then you go out and quit okay and a free game set up and let's see what we get we're gonna go ahead and try and pick up this yellow one we're on uh, uh, try one right now so try one should be the weak setting and the weak one was uh, 23 volts, I believe. So let's set it over there and get it on top of it. And let's see what it does. Nope, it missed it. So that was still uh, try one. So now we're gonna go to try two. And hopefully I can hit this one this time. Nope, missed it again. Okay, this is the third one, so it should actually go on 40 volts, and it should pick it up. I picked it up all the way, and dropped it in. There we go. That was one. So we got a win out of it, and the way mine is set up, and when you get a win, then it goes back to weak. So let's try and pick this one up. Hopefully I can get it. And it should drop it, and it dropped it. That was the first one. Let's try it again. And see, everything is if you get it exactly on there. Let's see, that's too far. There we go. Let's try that. Nope. It would have picked it up and dropped it. Now we're on the third one again. So this time it should pick it up and put it in. There it was. Okay, let's try it one more time. We'll do one in the back here. Let's try to get this one. This is the first time, so it should uh, fail to pick it up. It'll, it'll pick it up, but then it'll drop it. Drops, there it goes. And this one, it should pick it up and then drop it. The second one, I can't get it. <laughs> okay, so this one should be a, a strong one, so this should pick it up. But we're gonna not pick it up this time because you're gonna see that if it doesn't pick it up, it'll go to the next one and then should pick it up. So that this would be number four because you it didn't pick it up on that one. And it should pick it up and put it in. Okay, and now it's it's got a collection, so the next one should be weak. Should not pick it up. Oh, I missed it. These, are, these balls are actually a little hard to get. That should do it. It should pick it up and then set it down. Oh, man. Maybe I need to help it along. And this time it should pick it up and put it in there. There we go. I wanted to I want to show the the two times it doesn't drop it though. Or it drops it. Let's see if I can. So this is the first time. 
It should pick it up and drop it. It did. And then let me do it again. It should pick it up and then drop it. Oh, I did not drop it that time. <laughs> it made me a liar. Let's try it again. All right, we're gonna pick this one up and it should pick it up and then drop it. I dropped it. Okay, we're gonna do it again. It should pick it up and then drop this one too. And it dropped it. And then this next time it should pick it up and it should put it in and win. Oh, that was off. There it goes. Okay. So that was it. That was the settings on it. That's how you set everything up. Um, that's about it. So uh, uh, go ahead and give me a like if you liked it. Um, subscribe if you haven't already. And leave any kind of comment you want about anything. I'll try and answer anything anybody has. Okay. Thanks again. Have a good one.